you're not going to believe the heavenly experience Pasha Lake Cabins owner Chad Thompson and I had at Lake Nipigon, Ontario this last spring. Even having been there, I'm still finding it hard to believe myself. So stay with us for more fine brook trout action to come. I don't know what I got here, but this is a big fish. The next day it got windy. So we found a pattern there that was completely different than what we did the day before, only I stayed with the same baits because they were eating them. And I hooked into a fish and I thought, oh my God, this is a big fish, this is a heavy fish. I was only using a, a, a little short five foot or six foot three inch rod. The fish came up one time and rolled right under the surface. In search of the next world record brook trout, Chad and I are pitching jigs to windblown points with deeper water nearby. When you're on a, a lake like Nipigon, that you know the world record brook trout is 10 to 11 pounds, whatever it is, somewhere in there. And you know that there are more than one new potential world records in this lake. That's an incredible feeling. I mean, how many times have you ever had that feeling being on the lake and the kind of fish you're going after, you know that the new world record is here and it might be on this next cast. There he is. Got him? Yes. Big fish. Big fish? Better run the motor. Me? Yep. Okay. No trolling motor. I don't know what I got here, but this is a big fish. Oh my God! The brook trout! Tell me when and I'll come back and net come it. Come now! Get the rod all over. Get back up in the motor. Okay, come on. See him. Go ahead, that's bigger than that. Just a nine, ten pound fish. No, right up by your feet, your feet, you're underneath you. Okay. Ready? No. That, yes. Come on back. Oh my God, is this a big fish. Please, Lord, let me land this fish. A lake trout, I think. Not. No. Shooting bubbles. They both try. Oh, it is a lake. Good, I thought I had a 10, 12 pound rookie. I seen him flash down. Ah! It's on the bubble. Ah. 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 It's not a nice lake truck. Why don't you like lake truck? But I seen that fish and I would have bet you all the money in the world that was a brook trout that was over 10 pounds. My Lord, my heart is just going. Ah! Well, thank you, Mr. Trout. <laughs> oh, was that exciting. This is my new world record brook trout. <laughs> that is of the char family, just like the brookies are. Lake trout and brook trout, do you know that? They're both Arctic char? Yep. Oh, Got a little you, bit fish. of a belly on them. <laughs> Oh, I seen that fish. Oh, I'm not telling you. I'm, I'm just in the inside deflated. I mean, when you're on a lake that you know has the next world record brook trout in it, bar nothing, 
and you see something like that come up, and I just seen those markings on his back and the green, as it swirled and went down. Yep. Oh, Lord. We got the bugger. Yep. If that would have been the brook trout, he'd have been in the boat. Well, I don't know what we're going to top do to top that feeling. I, I know what we can do. Catch a 10 pound brook trout. Oh, that, that'll do her. I would have bet that that was a brook trout and that it was going to be over 10 pounds of brook trout. I cannot tell you what I felt like in the inside in my heart and my mind and my breathing and my heart was just going crazy and I'm fighting it and I can't get the dang thing to come up and cooperate. You're just fighting deep and deep and Chad's freaked out and the wind's blowing into it and I said, you got to run the trolling motor. Well, he'd never used a trolling motor like that before. So we just about piled into that rock pile. You didn't see that on the show, but that happened. And we got her out and away from there. Some finally wore her down enough where we could see her and gut her into the net and it was a lake trout, a short, fat lake trout. And I'm thinking it's a 10 pound brook trout the entire time. I mean, it was a wonderful fight and I loved it and everything else, but what a letdown when you think, man, you got the fish that nobody else catches. You just don't catch 10 pound brook trout. But that lake has them and I knew that and I thought I had one. I'll never forget that, and you won't either if you go up there and try it for yourself. Hey, I hope you're really enjoying our new content. If you do, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, and uh, thank you so much.